Hey, so recently, guys, I've just been uh, not been able to sleep because every time I just think to myself, man, I really, really would like a fat Pikachu lunchbox and I really wish they made one. Hey, what's up, guys? Hopefully, you're all doing okay today. So, today we're going to open up the 2020 Fall Collector's Chest, or as yes, you can probably just call it, the the chunk of chew lunch tin either way works um so yeah we got ourselves here this is supposed to come with i think two darkness ablaze packs a cosmic eclipse and a sunny moon base set and i think crimson invasion but i could be wrong in the last one i can't even tell it's like all mushed up in the corner there so i can't really see what that one is it's supposed to come with uh, sorry for the sniffle it's supposed to also come with three promo cards of cinderace rillaboom and inteleon and then a mini binder and some stickers pretty Pretty, pretty cool, pretty pretty cool, man. I also I really like stickers. And um, let's take a close look at in here, so we can see here. Actually, you know, I think we can take a, probably a better look out of it once we bust it open. So let's uh, let's take the condom off of it and let's just jump right into it. Alright, so here we got the Chunky Chew Lunchbox. It's all in all of its glory. I have the cardboard stuck in my back chair, so we're just gonna lean on it. Um, very, I actually really like the colors on this. It's very nice, very vivid. And then on the back here, we do have Rillaboon, Cinderace, and Inteleon here. And then on this side, we have the V Max Charizard, or Gigantamax Charizard, whichever one you call it. And all oh, nicely, a pretty solid looking tin. Let's turn this puppy on its side and, um,. I'll see what else is in here waiting for us. Ooh, okay, I uh, I wish it was the other way around, but we'll take a look at that in a second. And then, oh, actually, what the fuck? It does come with Vivid Voltage. Hang on. We'll take a look at the packs here in a second. I saw I saw a Vivid Voltage pack. And then we have... Following this side. I think this is just all the... Yeah, okay. Put that inside. So here's the stickers you get. Very cool. Um, so we got this sticker, this sticker, this sticker, and this sticker. I never take the stickers out because I consider these as like the collector's thing and uh, like, I, do, I don't understand why many collector's boxes use stickers because like if you stick it somewhere, it's basically useless and it's stuck there forever and it's it's all fucked. I, I hate when I do this so much. Then we got the mini binder. It's a mini binder. Again, I've never seen anyone actually use these so. I, I don't I don't know. It looks cool though. I'll keep that in the collection. And oh it comes with a notepad. Hang on. Alright, and very nifty looking notepad. Alright, that's enough of that. Let's uh I'm gonna clean this off really quick and we'll take a peek of everything else that's in here. Let me do let me do the quirky little snap transition. I actually don't know how to snap, so I that's I probably just have to add that sound effect in post because I, I can't snap. I have baby hands. Anyway, so during that transition, I did take the effort to pull the promo cards out of there because I usually have problems with that. So uh, let me just show those off really quick. So here we have in the Inteleon promo. Looks very, very clean. Then we got Rillaboon here. Very cool. He's out here playing, playing the drums like a good boy. And then here we have Cinderace here doing a fire kick. Very cool. And then you also do get a coin here. I don't think this coin's pretty good. I think it's... I think the coloring looks like... Okay, so like, let me show it. So we have a VMAX Charizard coin here. Um, I don't like it. You can barely tell what it is in my opinion. And it also has like a piss color, so... Not a fan of this coin, but you know, it's, it's whatever. It is what it is. So let's take a quick look at those packs here, because I'm actually very intrigued, because the... Well, to be honest, recently Pokemon with promoting their packs have been very... weird in my opinion. Like, I think the last time I've been caught off guard of what it actually has is these small but mighty boxes. Because if you look at the promotional images, it says it's supposed to have Vivid Voltage, but it's all just Darkness Ablaze. So I don't know what's going on there. I don't know if they're having miscommunication or what, but um... Uh, let's pull these off and see what they are. So here we have two vivid. Are we just don't get darkness ablaze? Is that it? So we have two vivid voltage packs. And then we have a sword and shield base set. 
then we got ourselves, okay, we got ourselves a burning shadow, okay, that was on the corner, and then we get a sun and moon, huh, so we don't get any darkness of lace packs, which, which still confuses me, because VMAX Charizard is here, and that card is in darkness of lace, I'm super, and then here's the cold card for, hang on, hang on, I'm just, uh, here you go, I don't really use these from time to time, so, uh, but notes on that, I know my last one I forgot to give the half of it, I can't find that card anymore, so, I'm sorry, but, um, uh, man, I'm actually kind of disappointed I didn't have Darkness of Blaze, because I knew these might not have had vivid voltage, so I actually went out and picked two up for this video, but, um, uh, I mean, I guess, I'm, you know what, I'm just gonna crack open vivid voltage, how about that, we'll just add them there, alright, so I'm gonna move this a little bit, and then I will open up these packs. Quirky snap. Alright, that, that didn't work again, because again, I can't snap, but anyway. Um, so I went out to the effort of organizing these in the ways I wanted to open. And then you know what I also realized that also annoys me is that they didn't include my the Cosmic Eclipse, which sucks because I like that set and I wanted to open more cards. And I'm having a hard time finding those cards at their normal price. I mean, it's I mean I hope the reprint comes soon, but anyway, that's besides the point. That's a whole other story in itself. So um let's just start getting into these weird packs I guess all right so we got ourselves the sword and shield base set let's start cracking this puppy open oh man what do I even want from I think the only card I actually want from base set sword and shield if I even get to it is the VMAX Snorlax the one that's like in the the one that's in the you know the front where it's like it has all like the land and stuff you, you, you guys know the one I'm talking about probably put a picture because I am rambling, and then we just get rid of relief energy. Alright, let's see what we got here. So we have Galarian Lanoon, a Sea King, Ordinary Rod, a Krabby, Cufant, Baltoy, Salandit, Galarian Ponyta, and then we have ourselves a Blip Bug for a reverse, and at the end we get. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Starting wow. strong, we got ourselves a Stone Journer. Stone Journer? Yeah, Stone Journer V card. Very nice looking. Just a, just a rock. All right, all right, starting off pretty strong. Hopefully we didn't use all of our luck there. Let me, oh, sorry, bump to the camera again. Let me move this to the side. All right, let's move into our next pack. Yeah, almost did that, oh, almost did that off screen. That would not have been good. All right, we're gonna move to a Vivid Voltage next. So, I'm still, yeah, I'm still mostly bummed about the Cosmic Eclipse. But, you know, it is what it is. We still got packs, so can't really complain too much. Oh, uh, here's our vivid voltage. I'm trying to show the QR code so that, um, people actually have a chance to type it in. So people just don't come in and scan all of it. So we got Ferrothorn, we got Gogo, -Go, we got Pochina. You know, I don't think last week I talked about which cards I really wanted from Vivid Voltage, and I think the obviously I want Chunkachu, but the other one I really want. Is the Bay Flower card because I'm also a very big fan of um, I'm a big fan of Bay to be honest B B not Bay I mean Bay B is Bay but um, very big fan of B and I would really like her full art card I want both of them to be honest both the Rainbow and the Full Trainer and of course I also do want the big chunk of you and I do also would like the amazing rares all of them I have two so far so. Still got ways to go on that. Here's the code card for vivid voltage. Turn that around. And we go. Darkness energy. I always feel like when I'm opening packs, I don't know what to say and I tend to ramble. Which kind of kind of be the stinky, but you know, it is what it is, I guess, until I figure out what to say during these parts. Here we also have a picky pack, putting a Puccina into a rock rough into the reversible fortress and at the back we get a grap lock Ooh, we get shit on we actually get shit on let me just organize my book pile here all right back to, into some sun and moon some old classic stuff i put the burning shadow the last because you know that has a chance of pulling that rainbow charge are very slim chances but you know you don't know if you don't try cracking this open toss the side and then we pull this off, and then here's your Sun and Moon code card. Alright, one, two, three to the that's three, right? Yeah, three to the front. And we get rid of the fire energy. Alrighty. We got ourselves a Passaman into a Lima. You go into Spinda, Shelder, Zubat, 
Poplio, Stuffle, Wingle, a Reverse of Poliwag, and at the end we get a Parasect. This is not looking good for us. We have only pulled one good card and we're down to three packs. Holy moly. We are getting shit on. Uh, you know what? Let's do the Zarude pack first. Let's do that. Let's see. Hopefully that gives us something here. Oh, hang on. Sorry, it's because my something bothered me really quick. Alright. I hope I... I might have to cut that part out just because I've had to fix something, but, um... I really hope I don't because... If I get something good from here, it's gonna look like I fucking staged it, and I don't want—I don't want to look like that. All right, we get rid of the electric energy. Ooh, is that a sign for Fat Pikachu? I hope so. All right, Cramorant. We got ourselves a Rotom Drone, a Swoobat into a Joltik. We go to a Cottony, then we go to a Mudbray, and to a Slugma. We got Wishmer. Then we got Reverse of a Rock Ruff, and at the end we get a ooh a Zerud V from the Zerud pack. That Amazing. is hecka nice, hecka nice. All right, we're gonna put you down to the side here. Oh man, that's that's some. I swear to God, I did not stage that. Just putting it out there, I would never do that, ever. Alrighty, so we got we're down to our last two packs. We got ourselves a Vivid Voltage and a Burning Shadows. Let's uh open up. Oh, also, I forgot to mention this in my last video. I remember it was a while ago when I made an update video, quite a while ago, saying I was going to make a Hat in Time Let's Play. I forgot to inform you what's going on with that. So, I recorded the first episode. I think I need like to edit down four more minutes of it, and then it's good to post. Um, so yeah, with that one, I have no schedule. Oh, there's Anessa. I have no schedule of how that's going to run or when is that going to come out. It's just going to come out when it comes out. So, um, I figured I'd let you guys know on that. Mud Brave, we got ourselves a Poochina, and then we got a, ooh, a Charmander. All right, and then we got a Wooper Reverse, and at the end we get a Al Creamy. Regular Rare. All right, we only got two pulls so far, which is very... Very frustrating, but well, it's not that frustrating. It's kind of good, but at the end, it's like I want more. All right, oh, burning shadow pack cold. It opens like this. Cool. Please give me something good, burning shadows. I remember last uh, video, it gave me something really good. It gave me like a full art, a full art. So hopefully, it continues that and it gives me something really well. So we got ourselves a Cedra, a Rotom Ducks. Super Scoop Up, a Crab, Crab, Crabbler, Crabbler, Inkay, a Lediba, a Caterpie going into a Sandy Gast, themselves a Reversible Dusk Noir, and at the end we get a regular rare Lady, Ledian. Wow, okay, this, this box kind of didn't deliver, but, um, well, you know what, it is what it is, that's, that's just the gamble you take with Pokemon cards. So, at the end, we only managed to pull two cards, we got ourselves our... Storm Droner, Storm Droner V, and we got ourselves Ares Root V, which is pretty cool. We got the new Pokemon in the TCG and the new pack, so I mean, that's not that bad. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. It's a little bit quicker than my last ones, but, um, yeah, hope you guys did enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next one.